the National Archives records were a treasure trove for us. One thing they contained were the commander's logs from May through November of 1967, but they also contained the grid maps, and grid maps detailing the movements of Tiger Force during that seven month period. What we wanted to do was we wanted to tell the full story of Tiger Force, not only from interviewing the veterans, army officials, investigators, but to really tell the whole story, we felt that we needed to go to Vietnam and try to find the victims. We proposed to our editors that we would go to Vietnam using these grid maps. We would be able to trace their movements and perhaps there would be people in these villages that would remember Tiger Force. Maybe they were witnesses. Um, it was a hard sell. You have to remember that The Blade is a, is a family-owned newspaper. This isn't a chain newspaper like a Gannett or a Knight Ritter, which has the resources. We went into the meeting and we said, we want to go. This is what we need to do to make this a better story, to tell the full story. Our editors looked at us like we were crazy. And you want to go to where? And at that point, there was a lot of hesitation and you could cut the tension in the room with a knife. And Mike looked at the editors and without flinching said, you know what, if you guys aren't going to pay for this, we're going to take our vacation and we're going to go there ourselves. And of course, I'm thinking, okay, Mike, I'm figuring out in my head, well, how much is it actually going to cost <laughs> to put this on my visa and get over there? But the, the key was our, our executive editor at the time, I think, recognized that. It was a good story. And in order to get this trip approved, um, he arranged a meeting with our publisher, John Robinson Block. And Mike and I went to Pittsburgh. And we met with um, the publisher, as well as the publisher for the Pittsburgh Post-Gazette, David Shribman. We told them what we had discovered, the documents, um, the interviews. And to their credit, they approved the trip. They approved the trip for Mike and I to go along with a photographer.